Hello and welcome to FreeTradingVideos.com. This is D7. Let's look at the markets. And to all of our veterans out there and those who are in active forces today, thank you for your sacrifice. Thank you for what you do for the country of the United States of America. We here at Free Trading Videos salute you, and we wanted to extend our sincere appreciation for all that you do. All right, let's get on with this, the S&P. We're up today a half a percent down, not quite a half a percent. NASDAQ here, 0.74%, almost a full percent here on the Russells. The VIX showing positive, meaning there's some fear in the market. And let's talk about why that may be. Here at the S&P Daily, we come up and we're smacking our head right here at this 1100. We wait, made it to 11.05. This is our high today, but we came right back down. It's finding resistance right here at 1100. That's why I have this red line here. What type of reversal pattern is this? And this could be one of two reversal patterns that I want you to know about. And I want you to uh, tell me which two this could be. So anyway, uh, put those down in the comments. Let me know what you think there. And what will I be playing probably tomorrow, which should put us on Thursday. If we get a lower low and close lower than this, I'm looking for a drop. But we're going to find support right here around the 1080 to 1083 area. So if we do drop, think it, know that that's going to be a support area. If we continue higher, I, I see us getting, oh wow, that would be a huge candle if we were to get up here. Uh, 1120. That would be a big time. That would be a long way away. Uh, maybe splitting the difference at 1110, but no higher than 1120 tomorrow. Or because we're caught up in this area, resistance area, we could just do a sideways move right here. So I gave you a target area to the downside and a couple target areas to the upside. But I think that we have a better chance of probably just hanging up here the next couple days until this next week. And let me share with you why I say that. We're at Spiders, and I'm going here to look at just volume, measuring this, and volume continues to be small. I mean, look at this. We are really light volume here, gang. Very light. And, and here you can see this reversal pattern right there on the spiders and this would I would only consider one reversal pattern perhaps maybe two so we're at major resistance right here and let me show you something very interesting going to the NASDAQ the NASDAQ if I go back in time a little bit here this had a really nice trend going look at this nice uptrend nice nice uptrend we hit right there nice parallel lines and then we come up here hit our head and high base high base and it actually drops and we made a rising wedge the rising wedge broke down right here you can see it getting down below that resistance point and what happens when you break resistance you fall and boom we fell we fell and then we get a reversal pattern right there we come right there we head back up and and this is where we're at right now right boom look at this we're what was acting as support now is acting as resistance and we have a re reversal pattern there also. So because there's resistance, we hung up here many, many days. And I could see us doing the same thing right here, going into the future. But if we do start a down leg, it could get ugly and fast. And you can see here on the MACD that we're starting to get a dissipation in these ticks on the histogram. See how they're getting smaller and smaller? That means we're getting closer and closer of getting a turnaround or a crossover taking place here on the MACD. So there you are. Thank you for being a part of Free Trading Videos. Looking forward to all those that are going to join us for the Mentor Program on December 5th, 6th, and 7th. And if you'd like more information on that, just go to services, fill out your information, we'll invite you to a private uh, Tuesday night webinar where you can hear more about it. Take care. Happy trading.